So Dr. Dalton Wood has graciously volunteered um, for me to be able to do an acupuncture treatment on him and video record everything so that I can kind of show you what a typical treatment looks like here with me. Um, I do have a special program system that I use um, that helps me kind of graph and explain everything what and make my treatment um, very unique and individualized. So I'll kind of go through and let you see kind of what goes down and then I um, can always talk about um, kind of what it is that I'm using. So I hope you enjoy. So this is just the examination portion. Um, before each visit, I, I do what I call, I graph. I graph the patient. So what it does is it is um, essentially, it is gathering data um, on the individual patient and it is calculating um, skin resistance um, at each acupuncture point so that we can kind of gauge what the meridians are doing within the body. So that is a pretty painless exam. So basically it is just a wet Q-tip um, that I'm putting pressure at different acupuncture spots within the ankles and the wrists. Um, so those are the most active spots in each meridian. So like I said, it's just measuring skin resistance to each of those meridians to kind of give us a better idea of what's going on inside. And what it will do is it will kind of create an image or a graph that I can discuss with you um, and you will be surprised at how accurate some of the symptoms um, it tells me that you might be experiencing that you didn't even tell me, um, but it just really helps me individualize my treatments um, each time so that we can improve um, kind of what's going on with your symptoms. All right, so then what my machine does is it kind of pulls up this graph. I don't know if you can see it, um, but these are each of your meridians and they are measured so that you can see them and it makes it, it makes acupuncture make a little bit more sense. So each of these um, is a meridian that's running through your body and each of these different colors stands for different things. So this just helps me pinpoint kind of why um, and where you're feeling your symptoms or where they could be coming from so that I can um, make my treatment a little bit more um, specific versus if you come in for, you know, uh, low back pain, I'm not going to treat you the exact same as I would, um, you know, somebody else that came in with low back pain. So this just helps personalize it, which helps me get better results for you. So now I just wanted to go through kind of what I look for and look through in these graphs because it is so oddly precise at what it tells me that sometimes I can tell a patient their symptoms before they even know or before they even tell me. Um, so basically what I look for, so this graph, like I said, it measures the skin resistance at each um, of the highest energy points along the meridian. So you have 12 meridians. Um, so like I said, it is measuring the skin resistance to kind of see, basically measure the voltage of what those energy channels are doing. And then it paints you a nice little picture of what is going on. So I'll kind of break down what each, what all of this is. So you have each one is a meridian right here, and then you have two bar graphs on each one. So it's left to right of each of the meridians that run through your body. Um, and then what it does is it gets you these nice pretty colors. So green is good, that's what we want, right? So this is the average. It will actually calculate an average for your energy levels that day. Um, and then it'll tell me, the red is excess so there's too much here and the blue is low it's not enough there and then the purple is split from left to right so i'm going to kind of show you so like i said each of one of these is a meridian so this for example is your lung meridian so you can see there that when we're talking about meridians we don't just talk about their name and their organ that they might supply so yes the lung often refers to respiration and the organ the lung however you can see that it travels from the shoulder down into the hand so any physical symptoms a patient might be feeling like shoulder elbow carpal tunnel numbness and tingling in the thumb it can be affected by the lung meridian um, so then it's kind of cool to just go through and kind of piece together um, kind of what's going on. 
so then you can see and then it'll also pull up kind of an informational slide where it'll just tell me hey this is excess this is deficient these are symptoms you might have and i just go through with the patient and discuss like hey how's your digestion are you having congestion allergies asthma things like that and then it kind of tells a big, better story of what is going on and why you might be having symptoms so the goal is with my system of acupuncture is to get all of these meridians green so when they're all green that means that your body there's no background noise and it's able to function like it needs to to get rid of some of those symptoms that you're feeling so when everything is in perfect harmony when everything is green your body is able to do what it's supposed to do and you're going to notice a lot of your symptoms decrease or even go away So that's really cool and this is what I love about um, the graphing system that I have for acupuncture because it lets you see what's going on and visualize. And I actually do this before every single treatment so you can actually see progress each visit because a lot of times, especially when we're dealing with um, symptoms like anxiety, depression, um, blood pressure, things like that, they're not necessarily things that you're going to feel progress right away but this allows you to see progress because you, every graph will change and it should change, change is good. But what you'll notice is they'll all start to evolve and um, you know, become green or it'll actually, sometimes the graph that they have their first visit shows nothing of what they're currently complaining of. But after we sift through kind of some of that background noise, it pinpoints more precisely, like this is why you're having your symptoms, this is where it's coming from, which is kind of cool to see as we progress through a treatment.